A Mission Valley man contacted 10 News tonight because he says somebody is trying to kill his dogs in the neighborhood and a large amount of chocolate, you see it in this bag right here, was found on at least two patios. Chocolate can be deadly to dogs. 10 News anchor Itika Milana spoke to the man about the great lengths taken to hurt these dogs. Whoever did this had to climb this very steep hill to get to the top of those two homes. And then they placed almost a pound of chocolate in those patios. That's almost two of these giant chocolate bars. Yeah, they're totally like the biggest part of the family, you know. We care about them more than anything. Brian Labonte is sickened that someone tried to kill his dogs by poisoning them with chocolate. And there was a huge pile of chocolate right there by that flower pot. And then another pile right there by that plant. It happened to his next door neighbor at Escala too. The neighbor noticed the chocolate in his patio first, then looked into Labonte's backyard and saw candy there too. Luckily he alerted me to it, so I was able to come out before my dogs. Otherwise they would have come out and eaten everything. What police told Labonte gave him the chills. He did actually demonstrate to us that if it was just thrown into the yard that it would have been scattered more, but it was placed in a pile. Um, purposely. And it wasn't easy getting to his patio. The person had to climb this steep hill all the way up to the homes. So it's pretty, um, pretty disturbing that they would actually take the time to do that. Labonte kept the chocolate and will have it tested to see if it was laced with poison. It makes me feel violated. Now I have to come out with a flashlight every morning, check my yard and make sure there's nothing in it that'll harm them. Next time, is it going to be rat poison? In Mission Valley, Itika Milanis, 10 News.